Hey guys, welcome back to Popcorn in Bed. Thank you so much for being here. Tonight I'm watching Red Dawn. The only thing I know about this is that's Patrick Swayze. Could not even tell you the genre. So we had a YouTube live, which was like five hours of streaming and packages, and it was actually so much fun. And during it, I did a poll where I took my list of every DVD I've ever been sent, something like 2000, and I went, Brrr, stop, Brrr, stop, four movies, and then put those on a poll during the live. So right there, it won against Corpse Bride. It happened one night. I can't remember the other one. But Red Dawn was about 55% of the vote, so pretty overwhelming. And I will never say no to a Patrick Swayze film. I don't think I had seen one before the channel started. I have now seen a couple and adored him and the movies, especially Dirty Dancing. And so I'm excited for this. And oh, Point Break. Didn't, didn't love him in that one. Boaty, if you know, you know. Um, but Ghost and, uh, Dirty Dancing. But even in Point Break, I still liked being in the room with him, you know? Even if he wasn't a good guy. Okay, so, Red Dawn, going in pretty blind. I wish Carly was here to watch this one with me. She is on a work trip, but hopefully she can catch the next one. Okay, remember if you want to vote on polls like this all the time and get early access polling three actions and join a movie community, here's my Patreon. Don't forget to like and subscribe. It helps so much. Let's watch the show. Soviet Union suffers worst wheat harvest in 55 years, labor and food riots in Poland, Soviet troops invade. Cuba and Nicaragua reach troop strength goals of 500,000, El Salvador and Honduras fall. Green's party gains control of West German parliament, demands withdrawal of nuclear weapons from European soil. Mexico plunged into revolution. NATO resolves, United States stands alone. Oh wow, okay. That was a lot of information. September. So this is like a what if situation, right? Like all that stuff happened. No more NATO. The Rough Rider. For better to do many things, I'm doing with the board of Theodore Roosevelt. What's the deal? Get going. You don't have time for breakfast. Hi. Yeah, I'll be I'll be at the station all day, so uh, you're gonna have to hit your ride home. Later, bud. See you, Jed. Charlie Sheen. They are so young. And when this killing started, it lasts for days, weeks. Well, now, my friend. What in the world? Very unusual. What in the world? Go ahead, my friend. Oh my gosh, what? <gasps> what in the actual world? So this isn't a war or anything? They're just coming to do this to a school? Who are they? This makes... Sleeping bags and food. This. You can a lot of that. I'll get that like that. Get the shotgun now. Matt, look. It's a lot get of coke. Out, get out, get out, get out. Lay down. So is this happening, happening just in this city? Or is this happening everywhere in the United States at the same time? I love you, Dad. Tell Mom I love her. Yeah, I'll take care of it. Wait, why isn't the dad going too? Turn off quick. Ah! You 
You can't just rocket launch at random citizens! I do not have subtitles. It says speaking Russian, speaking Spanish. That's it. Well, I hope that wasn't a major plot point. Gotta stay up here and hide a while. I just want to go home. I mean, how long do you think we can survive up here on olives and rice krispies? What else are we gonna do? I forward the motion that we give ourselves up. I, I second the motion. We can't stay here. We, we need stuff. Sit down, Danny. Oh, poor Danny. You're such a goddamn jock. <clears throat> oh. Hey, come on, guys. <clears throat> this is your chance to get walking. It, it is World War III down there. People are being killed. Jed, what about your family? I can't tell what Jed is. Well, you think you're so smart, man. She's just a bunch of scared kids. What do you think you are? Alone, I guess. No, you're not. What do you say? <laughs> I'm with you. All right. Now the rest of you get going. But if you stay, you're gonna do exactly what I say, okay? So he must be like the guy that graduated a few years ago. They're all just kind of buds. Matt and I have been coming up in these mountains with our dad all of our lives. Well, they're brothers. Mm -hmm. We can stay up here a long, long time. Until we don't hear that no more. I got him! Right, you really eat He's still breathing! No, 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 no. Oh, they're camouflaging. It's your first time, isn't it? You gotta drink if it's your first. What's it taste like? Drink what? It's it's kind of salty, like a steak when you got a nosebleed, you know? Oh, no, 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 no. That's how you get E. coli or something. You'd be a real hunter. That's probably a myth. Oh, just pretend. Go ahead. Go okay. Go it, I don't buddy. think you have to drink at all. Maybe just a little tasty yeah. taste. Okay. His blood is yours. You know, my dad said that once you do that, there's going to be something different about you. I wonder if this is going to be like a Lord of the Flies situation up here in the mountains. The last of it. We need food. We need to know. All right, we'll go into town. How long were they up there? Yeah, there's no one here either. The stores are open. There's people everywhere. Oh. Maybe it's over. Jesus Christ. What is that? Lewis, how you doing? This is so weird. Was he scared of us? Hey, let's ask Alicia. She'll know. Oh, oh, Jed. Hi, how's your sister? What? You gotta get out of here. Well, we will, but first we gotta find out what's going on. Tom! They know who all of you are. They're looking for you. The KGB. KGB. Look, have, have, have you seen my father? I, I, I called. There was no answer. I'm gonna tell you something I'm not supposed to talk about. Nobody is. They took a lot of people away. People that had guns or things they wanted, they just took them away. Where? Re-education camps, that's what they call it. Oh my gosh. You will pass on the pledge of freedom fighters and watch the This is bizarre. I want to know, where's the president? What, where's, what, like... Could you find my dad, Tom Eckert? I'm Jed. Matt? Mr. Boris? I'll go find your dad. I know right where he is. Can you see if Mr. Morris is in there, too? I'll look around for him, too, sir. <laughs> What a nightmare. Ready? Boys, don't talk, don't say anything. Let me look at you. I was tough on both of you. And I did things that made you made you hate me sometime. But you understand now, don't you? Well, you hear what they do. Doesn't matter. For one reason or another, we're all gone. It's all what? gone. Remember when you used to go in the park and play? And I used to put you on the swings. Why does this feel like goodbye? Well, I ain't gonna be around to pick you up when you fall now. Both of you gotta take care of each other now. I'll never see you again, Dad. Yes, you will. I don't want to hear that, Maddie. What happened to Mom, Dad? Where is she? I can't afford to be crying anymore now. I don't want either one of you ever, ever cry for me again. They killed their mom? I'll never do it. But, but it's okay to cry. Go get going now. 
I love you. I know you do, son. I love you, too. Boys! Avenge me! <laughs> Sorry, I'm laughing because I feel like that's a line. People say, Avenge me! Come on, find your chair. Five weeks. <laughs> Five weeks? Well, we all figured you boys had headed for F.A. by now. What's F.A.? Free America. That's a safe zone. Hell, you boys is in occupied territory. Forty miles behind enemy lines. Mac dab in the middle of World War Three. Oh, they're not kidding. It's World War Three. We're looking for news, Mr. Mason. Yeah, we here just. So this is now occupied by Russia slash Cuba. Just like they just say we own you and that's it. Radio? That's all right. I got another one. Don't go to Calumet no more. How come? Uh, people waking up with their throats cut. Where it has is, it's you. It's no. Thing. What happened to my dad and mom? Your dad is dead, Robert. They shot him. The Russians found some guns missing. And we just took the stuff. We killed them. They killed him. Now, you boys listen to me and let that burn in real good. I ain't got nobody now. You boys need food, a bed, you need anything, you come here. How how come they're safe here? I got a couple of heirlooms I want to hide with you. Gosh, she just found out his dad is dead. My granddaughters. They spent two days sneaking here. Tony, Erica, they're going to take care of it. Holy cow. Good luck to you. I'll take care of them. Don't worry. Wow. So, okay. They're mountain men now. And for all of you out there on or behind the lines, this is your song. <laughs> so I'm guessing we're going to F.A. 40 miles in the wilderness. They're coming up. Let's go tell the others. <laughs> Their camo looks like giraffe print. Ah. I really think I'm supposed to know what they're saying. I really think I'm supposed to know what they're saying, guys. What are you doing? Um, why did we fight them? Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. He shot a lot of times, it looks like. Is he gonna try and drive in this suspicious condition? Oh, radio. Oh no. Wait, the dirty dancing girl in this too? Did I know that? There were people. Yeah, well, so was my dad. What was it like? It was good. I don't think it's for sure now. No one can ever go home again. Why don't you make yourself useful? You ain't ever doing your washing again. Me and her is as good as any of you. So what's up your ass? Shut up! You say that again, I'll kill you. He just took dirt in her face? Are we in grade school? I know this is very traumatic, but we gotta keep our ish together or... De aquí, todas las tropas. En grupos más pequeños, fuera de las áreas aseguradas. Luego, llama a Branchenko, que tenemos la área 8. Quiero algunos interrogatorios hechos. Empezando con el alcalde. You know in the new West Side Story, they didn't put subtitles for Spanish because... Our son is a prominent student leader. But not in a violent or physical way. Daryl, the... Uh... He's more of a politician, uh, like his father. If he's alive, he's scared, he's hungry, and he's just as anxious to avoid conflicts as you and me. He's not a troublemaker. Then who is? Well, let's just say it runs in some of the families. Uh, now, if you have any more problems, you call me, night or day. Thank you. Okay, this is getting serious. Yeah. Is that the one guy's dad? They were just at the funeral of the guys that the mountain men killed? That's pretty good camo, actually.
Huh? This is like too far. It's, this Don't just back. seems so. Pull it back. Let it turn to something else, okay? Don't cry. Don't you ever cry again. Oh, that's. They're gonna kill us. All of us. So why should we be different? Let it turn to something else. Let it turn to something else, Manny. I just. I don't. I don't know. Something feels wrong. Like it just. Um. What is she doing down here? Getting these supplies. Oh, rocket launcher. Okay. H how are they planning these things? I, I mean, Wolverines. Okay. Subtitles now. Pero estos son míos. Miss, maybe you speak at me for a minute, go. Um, I'll be right back, okay? Soviet American friendship center. Wolverine. Es un animal pequeño, como un tejón. Le llaman así al al colectivo local de los. Normalmente tendrás que matar a cada uno de ellos a pesar de no encarar. Siempre estuve del lado de los insurrectos. Tengo experiencia en estos casos. Me parece. Necesario ganar el apoyo del pueblo. Como los contrarios nuestros en Vietnam decían, ganar sus corazones When y sus hearts and minds. November. Oh my gosh, she's um she's someone. Is this one of the Wolverines? No, this guy came out of a parachute. You American? Red blooded. What kind of plane you fly? Well, I did fly an F 15. I'm an Eagle driver. He crashed? He had to eject? You the Honcho Sport? Who are you? Andrew Tanner, Lieutenant Colonel, U.S. Air Force. I'm Jed. How you doing, Jed? Oh boy, we're going in into winter, though. We need information, Colonel. First wave of the attack came in disguised as commercial and charter flights, same way they did in Afghanistan. They coordinated with selective nuke strikes, and the missiles were a hell of a lot more accurate than we thought. Key points of communication. Like what? what? Oh, like Omaha, Washington, Kansas City. Gone? Yeah. Jesus Christ. That's right. Gone? Russians reinforced with 60 divisions. Sent three whole army groups across the Bering Strait into Alaska to link up here in the middle, but we stopped their butt cold. Lines have pretty much stabilized now. The Russians need to take us in one piece, and that's why they're here now. That's why they won't use nukes anymore, and we won't either, not on our own soil. What started it? I don't know, two toughest kids on the block, I guess. That's simple. Maybe somebody just forgot what it was like. Well, who is on our side? 600 million screaming China. Last I heard, there were a billion. There were. China's on their side? Do you think this is how it would really happen? They've got the mountains, they've got the high ground. I feel like the girls might have been safer staying with their grandparents, but then I get that. How do they have them? There's half a million scarecrows in Denver would give anything one mouthful of what you got. They've been in the seas for about three months. They live on rats and sawdust bread and sometimes on each other. It's medieval. So no one wants to nuke each other. The lines are paralyzed. Is it time for a peace, tr peace treaty? I was going to say treaty and peace at the same time. Treaty. You made a new friend. She doesn't say much, does she? Something happened to her. Since she in high school, that guy seems like 45 and may or may not have a wife in Texas. 
back here by the drive-in screen or you're political prisoners. All right, we'll cause a diversion over here. Fire on all these machine gun positions. The B group comes across this area in a flanking maneuver, and when you reach this bunker, wow. you lay down grazing fire in this death lay. Step into the light. Oh! We're going right now. Oh, they're giving all the prisoners guns? Thought we were gonna try and fly out of here. All right, you okay? Well, you are down on the ground, isn't it? Well, you come down here. <laughs> How old's your wife? 80. What's she like? Old like me. Feisty like you. Couldn't stand it first, but once it took. Are you queer's plan or what? Maybe she's not in high school. They brought their kids, so they didn't have food enough to feed them through the winter. They want to give them to you, Jed. This is enough, Mr. Mason. I don't want any more. You're a leader now. Couldn't they just hang out at Mr. Morris's? But how did they find white suits? They must be stealing supplies from it's the ours! town. From it's theirs. ours! It's ours! What are they doing that to? They must have bases there. So this is a battlefield, huh? It's a real war, kid. It's here every day. Move it! These are not ours. Down, 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 down! Stay down! You can't see it! How do they get the tanks here? Oh, from, from Mexico? Just do something. Uh, this is Oh no, oh no, oh no. <gasps> no, no. Maybe the snowsuit. Come on, buddies, come and get him. Was a buffer? Go! Go! Okay, I think you got him. I'm never gonna be anybody again. Where are we gonna bury him? There's not much left to bury. Oh. Take them away from here, someplace safe. And as we remember, please let them forget, oh Lord, so they can be little again. So they're gonna stay and protect the town versus go and try to get to F.A. It's kind of strange, isn't it? On the mountains, pay us no attention at all. You laugh or you cry, the wind just keeps on blowing. It's Charlie Sheen. I feel like he has not got much screen time. Doesn't look good. They're all talking about quitting. It seemed like they lost stomach for it. And you? I'm your brother. Just make it count. February. They still haven't found them up there? Oh, this is the... They brought in a special guy to come take care of them? What are they tracking? Girl knows how to use a machine gun. How did they know they were coming? How could they be this prepared? Danny, the bolt's open, it's jammed. Shoot him! What is this thing? What is it? Where are they? <clears throat> this thing's got an arrow, it's, it's, uh, it's pointing. Where? Where? Right here. What are they tracking? Who's this? Where is it? Where is it? Who's this? They made me swallow it. Daryl, what have you done? You told them where we were, didn't you? My father turned me in. 
So Daryl's the bug? This bug on the Geneva Convention. I never heard of it. This isn't happening, Jet. Let him go. Shut up, Danny. Now get your rifles. No, we're not doing it. I'll do it. Tony, what's the difference between us and them? Couldn't they just send Daryl back to town? Uh... <laughs> Don't shoot, Jed. Don't shoot, Jed. Send him back to town. <gasps> oh, man, oh, man. Oh, that felt icky. Your brother's right. Someone has to be better. You know, this is making me think. And you know, one day you're just like living your normal life, you know, going through a Chick-fil-A drive through and the next day it's all just gone to hell and money means nothing and nothing means nothing except keeping your family safe and having enough and ah, I just, I don't. What's the smell? Ready? Wait, 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 don't stop. Wait, is that a trap? What do you say? Go, do it again. It seems like a trap. So we move to a more discreet location. Oh, I'm scared they're all gonna get sick, you know, like on Survivor, when they don't eat for so long and then they go and eat a big stuffed meal and they get very sick. Hide? <gasps> Are you freaking kidding me? Oh my gosh. How do you outrun these things? With horses? Wait, shouldn't we just hide under rocks or something? Do zigzags or something. We are not prepared for this. Tony! Hide, 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 hide. What's happening? Warrior! This cannot be how this ends. All these kids just die. This cannot be. I'll kill Jed. Don't let him get me. He's all make me talk. Where's your gun? I want you to do it. Oh my, no. Maybe we take... Maybe we try to fix her. Oh no! I can't. I can't, Tony. I can't. It's okay. Give me a grenade. I don't want to be too cold. Oh, this is not. Pull a pin for me. Oh my gosh. I'm just gonna stay here and listen to the wind a while, okay? We'll go. Oh my gosh, this is, this is terrible. This is... No! Oh my gosh. So she has to die alone and then her body gets blown? How does this end in any way that is okay? Do me your stuff, preliminary report. Me earth of Ragov with you. The video talk a navo. He grabbed her by the hair. We're gonna wait up here until the troops pull back into town. When they do, you can head off the planes. We're going with you, man. No, yeah. we're going with you. you. Listen to me. We are all that's left. Someone's gotta live. Somebody's gotta make it. Yeah. No. I'm never gonna forget. As long as I live. So cause a diversion. Get out of here. Head back to the mountains. I love you, Maddie. I know. Oh, that's what his dad said. It's hard being brothers, isn't it? 
parece que hace mil años que fui un niño en el sol. ¿Cómo llegué a este lugar tan alto? Tanto se ha perdido. Me parece todo tan lejos. Para mí ya no hay revolución. Voy a entregar mi resignación. How are they doing this? Maddie and Jen are doing all this? Or the armed citizens? And they're doing this so that Danny and the other girl can escape? This is their last hurrah? Oh no, oh no. It's gonna get him right in the back. Oh, the fox guy. Well, that's pretty sneaky. No. No. Don't see him. Did Mac get hit? Shot. Why did he say something? Why did he say it out loud? Oh my gosh. Vayan con Dios. You can rest now. Just hang on, man. Oh, man. Uh... Daddy will be here soon, man. Hang on, man. Please, this. This. Oh. We're free now. Free? I thought there was gonna be like a big government facility like welcoming them with hot showers and warm food and like, you know, like... I never saw the brothers again and I come to this place often. In the early days of World War III, In the early days gorillas. of World War III, gorillas, mostly children, placed the names of their lost upon this rock. They fought here alone gave up their lives so that this nation shall not perish from the earth. Leah Thompson. She's the Back to the Future girl, isn't she? Oh, man. That was not what I was expecting. I don't know about that one. <laughs> it was just like really, we're just really thrust in there right at the beginning. Don't really have any backstory, which happens in a lot of movies, but I felt it hard to connect with the characters throughout, I think because I didn't get any backstory at the beginning. Okay, so the whole idea of it, like what would have happened if like the Cold War went the other, or like the Russians invaded the US, right? Well, it just seemed too easy, but I guess that's what nuclear weapons would do, but they didn't use those there. I don't know, it all, it all... Okay, so the story aside, the actual movie, it just seemed kind of low budget to me. And that's probably because it's early 80s and I'm used to, you know, crazy effects and all this stuff. But even then, sometimes they screw that up though and it looks even more fake. But this just, even like the script, the acting, the dialogue was sometimes very cheesy and corny and... Avenge me, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. I definitely didn't hate it, and it made me think. It was an interesting concept, but I don't know. I think I just needed more dimension in the characters. And I had so many questions, like where did they get these weapons and all that? But that aside, like, I don't know. That was not what I was expecting, like a war movie at all. I don't know what I was expecting, but I guess not that. <laughs> I mean, for me, that's like a 5.5. It looked like they were using like a like an old 5.5 megapixel camera or something too. I don't know, it just never seemed clear, the audio and the shot. Maybe I had a bad copy. I don't know. I don't know. Overall, interesting storyline idea. Okay, tell me what you think of this, if you think I'm being too harsh, or if I'm just missing something. And thank you so much for watching along with me. As always, have a wonderful night.